Hi everyone, I am Johnny Man. Welcome back to another episode of Merlin's Magical Motel. And uh, we're continuing just at the last part of the last episode. I cut it off a little too short. I thought this was the end, and it actually wasn't. So I've had to jump back a little bit and do a bit of re-recording. But that's okay, because I found out that the last session I recorded, the video kind of got corrupted. So I've had to redo this anyway. So without further ado, let's get going. All right, so in the last episode, we... Uh, we ended here because I thought this was the end. Uh, we have a button there, which I thought was the end button. Uh, actually, it's not. So we have our getaway car. We have now successfully broken into the bank. So by clicking on the button, we get ourselves a saddle, which I don't think we need because it looks like our get car getaway car already has one. But we do get the all-important carrot on a fishing rod so we can drive our car. So we have to take our car all the way back following the path that we took. So we will just do this right now. We'll walk along our path carefully. Uh, I actually don't know what happens if the pig walks off onto the bad spots on our path. Uh, it might jump us back to the, to the safe there. But anyway, we'll just go through here and we'll finish up this episode. Or not this episode, this particular uh, room and move on to the next. So we're almost there. We are out. And there we go. We get here successfully with our getaway car. We saw the room open up, and there's our button to the next level. Okay, where's the door? All right, uh, so this one... This one I had already recorded, but something happened with the video file. It was a little bit corrupted, so I'm going to redo it here for you now. I will go through some of the motions that I did. It might go a little quicker than I did the first time, but let's continue. So, where's the door? Uh, so yeah, so first I started off just walking around, and we'll do that right now. We're just kind of searching around for everything, and we see a pressure plate there, so we'll come back to that. Uh, in my initial investigation of the room, we've got the cobwebs, which we can't do anything with right now. And we've got that pressure plate, seems to be the only thing that we have at our disposal. Although we do have, if you see up there, I think we got an anvil stuck in the cobwebs. So without further, further ado, let's uh, step on our pressure plate opens up this and it gives us a sword and guess what we can do with the sword folks we can get at the cobwebs so if we come up here and we get at that cobweb boom we are able to knock down that anvil and bust a hole in the floor which is great so I think we'll go down there and we'll check out what's going on down here sure enough we have a couple more pressure plates and let's see what happens Oh, there you go. If you see, it gave us a bow. Now, this is the tricky thing. We have a bow, but we don't have arrows. And if we can look through that window right up there, I'm guessing that's our end button. So, we have to figure out how do we get arrows. Well, we do have a trapdoor up here. And you'll notice that when we open this up, it's going to pile some stuff right here make this pillar a little taller. Boom. There we go. So our pillar's a little bit taller. Great. How do we get there? We've got a... We can't shoot up there because we don't have any arrows. And we need arrows, I think, to be able to shoot way off there through the window and hit that button. But we need to be able to get up here to... Because if you look up here, I wonder if I can get... There we go. See, there's a button right up in the top there. And you need to get on that platform to hit it. Well, the logical would be to try to jump over there and... But... This roof keeps banging our heads so every time we try. But what I did notice, and this took me quite, this took me a little while. I was running around, looking around. You notice this part of the floor is a different color. Interesting. And we got a bookcase here. Well, it took me a while to figure out that I can come behind this bookcase and give it a push. There we go. So that was what I needed to do. That gets us onto this bookcase. Whoops. Uh, which was a bad jump for me. <laughs> we'll try this. We'll try this again. We go up here, and now we can easily hit the button. And there's our arrows, just like I was thinking. So we can now get our bow, and let's see if we can hit this button. Oh, oh, oh. slowly get my aim. Oh. Nope. Oh, I did. I must have hit it. There we go. Open up the room. Give us another button to go on to the next level. 
So I know that, that was pretty fast. It's just I had played through that before and I didn't want to waste any time uh, with that one. So let's move on. It's dark down here. All right. So I have played a little bit of this one because, again, this, this ended up on that bad video file I had. So we will look around and see what we've got. So we've got a pit with uh, looks like, I guess that would be me. Um, and I'll just show you if we go in the pit, we light up one of those lights. But if we come out of the pit, the light goes off. So there's going to be three tasks we have to do, which are going, which once we get those done, that's going to open up this door here, and that will probably have our button. So let's just look around a bit more. What do we have? We've got some paintings on the walls. Not much in here. Got a little kitchen area with a couple of furnaces. Got a crafting table. Okay, not much here, so keep on looking around. I believe there's an upstairs. Uh, we'll look around in here. And we can climb up, but don't know that, that actually gets us anything. We got a big tree in here. Oh, nothing in there. Well, let's go upstairs and take a look, see what we've got up here. Okay, we've got another room. We've got some sofas and a cool pattern on the wall with a button. Well, we'll push that in a minute and see what happens there. Trees there. Well, we'll come back here. There's more down here. Let's take a look. I want to take a look at everything first and then see what we can figure out. Okay, we've got another room. Oh, okay, we've got lots of buttons here. Anything in here? Nope, just a painting. Whoops, sorry. <laughs> um, okay. Oh, okay, push that. Oh, that kind of reset it. And that does nothing. Okay, some of these change and... Some of them seem to reset. Okay, well, we'll have to figure that out. Uh, interesting. Anything else down at the end here? Nope. We can't do anything to the bushes. Okay, well, let's go back to this other room. There's a button in there. Let's see what that does. Okay, so we've got this decorative tripwire hooks. Okay, that's fine. Well, let's push this button here. Oh, oh. Oh, I think that opened this up. Yeah, I don't think this was here. Oh, okay. And another button. All right. And that gave us some iron. Huh. That just seems to give us three pieces of iron every time. Okay, well. Interesting. Now there is... It just seems odd, like there's kind of a pattern here. I wonder if we'll see that somewhere else. We get iron here. We have that room down here that has all those buttons on the wall that some seem to light up and some seem to get reset. Huh. Okay, well, let's go back around, see if this has give us, given us any clues, any ideas. Go back down here to the bottom floor. Nothing opened. Any, nope, no lights are on. Oh, anything in the pool? I'll go for a swim. Woo! No, I don't see anything in the pool. Okay. Anything change in here? Nope. Hmm. Anything behind these paintings? I always I always think there's something behind the paintings. That's why I keep knocking them down, because they might be sneaky and put something back there. Okay. Nothing there. Ooh. Okay, we got a pattern here. Interesting. Oh, hey, wait a minute. That, that looks like what, um, oh, the room up top with the buttons. Yeah. 
Okay, okay, hold on. So three at the bottom, one up, and top corner. Okay, let's let's just see if that's if that's right. Okay, three bottom. Okay, good. Because it looks like the um, looks like that same thing on the wall up here in this other room. Let's go up here, take a look. Yeah, see, it's the same sort of material. So it was three at the bottom. And one up, and where was the other one? Oh, I forget. Was it right there? Oh, no, it wasn't that one. Okay, let's try that again. Okay, so they're staying lit. Was it that one? Oh, hey! Oh, did you hear that? Had a little tone and it gave me some sticks. All right. Okay, anything change over here? No? Can you do anything? No? You're still here? You used to give me iron? Yep. Huh. Okay. So we have sticks. We have iron. What are we supposed to do with those? Oh, hey. Oh, there we go. Okay, so we got uh, got that lit, and that was probably from doing that up that pattern upstairs. All right. Um, yeah. Well, if I jump down here, too lit. Anything? Nope. Hmm. So we need to do something else. What do we need to do? Huh. Well, I know we can use this, these materials to make certain tools. I just don't know what we're going to make. We can make a shovel. We can make a pickaxe. We can make, a, we can make an axe. We can make shears. We can make a bunch of things, but... Well, might as well just start making some stuff and... Uh, see what we can do. Well, let me make an axe. I'll make a pickaxe. Make some shears and a shovel. So yeah, I'm just gonna kind of go around and see what uh, what mischief I can get into, and we'll come back once I can figure out what we have to do. All right, we're back, and uh, <laughs> I uh, was been walking around with all the different tools trying to break stuff, and I walked in here with the sh axe in my hand, and this tree just disappeared. And in looking around after the fact. As you see, we have the second light, which is good. Uh, I looked around after the fact to see if there was anything that might give me a clue, and it's right in front of my face, right above the crafting table. There's a little legend, and if you look, we have steel, 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 and two sticks, which is the recipe for making an axe. So it was right there in front of me, and I didn't even see it. I was just too eager to go exploring and doing stuff. So now that we've got those two... Um, I'm hoping that when I jump in here, the door will stay open. It won't close when I come out, because otherwise I don't know what to do. Well, we'll give it a shot, and we'll see what happens. So I'll jump down here. Okay, we saw the door open. Third light up, or third window lit up. Um, okay, fingers crossed that uh, I don't have to stay in here, because I don't know how I'm going to do that. Let's see. Does it stay open? Does it stay open? Run, 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 run. Okay. I wasn't sure. Uh, I wasn't sure. Great. So, we did that. That's awesome. That was pretty cool. I like that. Okay, let's go on to the next one. Hidden artwork. All right. Um, sure. Okay, we have buttons all around, and looks like each button has a color. Okay. We've got a bedroom. Interesting. Anything up here? No. No. Okay. Um. Yeah. What about stairs? What are these? Where do these go? Oh, that goes nowhere. That goes nowhere. Got all these different colored patterns all over the place. Got a ladder. What's up here? Okay, let's go up top. Nothing up here. Oh, 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 okay. Tricky, tricky. They're hiding a color. 
They're hiding a color up here. I wonder if that's a color we need. Hmm. Okay, well, let's, uh, that do anything? Did that, did that do anything? I'm not sure if that did anything. Let me try another one. Okay, let's just look around here. Okay. Okay, let's try the yellow. Oh, hey, wait a minute. Changing that color. Change the color of this tablecloth. Right? It's yellow. Ah, okay. That's changing color. So whatever color I click on, that tablecloth becomes that color. Okay, that's a start. What do we do with that? <laughs> Anything here? Nope. Sorry. You gonna help us? Hey? Hey, you gonna help us? You're no help. Um, yeah. All right. So we can change this color. But what does that mean? Did we miss anything in here? I don't think we missed anything in here. Can't get up there. Oh, let's see if I can get up there. Oh, hey. Whoa. Oh, okay. I'm painting the bed. Interesting. And it's... Oh, wait a minute. That's the color. And oh, Hold on, let me try something. So if I change to this color, so that's green. Does that mean I'm painting in that color now? Ah, it does. Okay. So, we have to change the colors and paint the bed. But which one? I'm guessing, let's see. We've got what? One, two, three. One, two, three, four. So, about three by four. That's too big. That's three by five. I, it's probably this one. And sure enough, that dark green, there's that dark green, which is that hidden one up there. So... I was right about that. They, they hid one of the colors up there to try to get that. So, what do we got selected? We've got this light green. And that's going to be this little uh, kind of rotated L shape. So, let's do that. Um, I guess it really doesn't matter. It's going to be that. No, okay, we'll have to carve out the other colors. So, what do we have down here? We've got orange and yellow. So, let's do yellow. Now, what do I need for yellow? I need... Those top two and the bottom corner. So I think that means I need this. Okay, yes. And then we go over here. That. Okay, I think that's right. Is that not right? Top two and the bottom color corner. Okay. Orange. Now orange is just those two pieces. Let's get orange. Go over here. Okay, we have orange selected. Let's run back here. So again, it's going to put that little dot for that, uh, as I said, that L shape or T shape and that top corner. So let's do the top corner. Oh, that's already orange. Okay. Now I need to make sure I jump up at the right spot and it's going to be this one. All right. Perfect. 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 Now I need that dark green. Okay. So let's go up here and get the dark green, and we might actually have this one solved. That'll be good. Okay, up, 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 up. And dark green, it's selected. Oof. And it's the bottom two, and then in between the orange and the yellow. So it's going to be that one. Careful, that one. Jump off. And it should be that one and that one. Okay, let's just double check. Yellow, yellow, orange. Yep. We have the lime green little TL shape thing. We got green coming down beside it with orange. Okay, that's perfect. And oh, oh, there was a wall up. Okay, good. That opened up this up here. I remember coming up here to see what was here, and it was a wall. There we go. Hey, we did that one. Awesome. That was pretty cool. I like that one. That was a good puzzle. Okay, next one. What do we have? 
small tree. Okay. Um, a tree and a hopper. And... Okay, what do we... Food. I need food in order to grow. That's this big, pretty flower. All right, and it's... Also got a hopper. Okay, um, yeah. What do I do? So I guess we just look around first and see what we're dealing with. Uh, anything hidden back here? No. Interesting. Got some cobweb. Oh, oh, there's, there's a button. Okay. Oh, what's that? A rabbit's foot. Another rabbit's foot. Okay, so this just keeps giving me rabbit's feet. All right. Not sure if what that's going to need. And what do I got around here? Nothing. Lots of cobwebs. Anything back here? Hope I'm not missing anything. I always feel like I'm going too fast and I'm going right past something obvious. Anything here? Nope. Well, I, let's... Let's just break this up a bit. Okay, can I give it to you? Oh. Something happened. Did you see that light come on and you heard the notes? Something happened. Hmm. Not doing it again. So what happened? I really wish I knew what happened. Oh. Oh, there's a button up there. Can I get that button? Does not seem to have done anything. Okay, what about you? Can I give you a rubber foot? No. Oh. Got a window out to the outside. Cool. All right. Um, yeah. What do we do? Where do we go? Let's keep looking around. Maybe I, I missed something. Okay. All right. Uh, okay. No, don't want to go there. Can I go up here? Okay. See, it looks like these trees go up. It looks like there's something up in the trees. I wonder what that is. Okay. Um, hmm. Can I... Get, okay. Can I get up here? All right. Uh, this is good, I guess. What is that? Oh, that looks like an airplane. Oh, so it's like an airplane crashed up in the tree. Oh, I just, I think that means I have to go all, I got to find my way up there. <laughs> all right. Um, yeah. Okay, we've got back up here a little ways. I'm uh, just trying to figure out which is the best route to go. Uh, I'm kind of thinking that looks like a staircase kind of thing there so we will work our way over here all right um oh no i think i want to be up here oh we can climb up these there we go okay this is better all right we're on some branches let's see if this gets us where we need to go okay we keep going up oh that there's the plane okay we're getting closer um okay Perfect. Okay, we're on the plane. Um, oh, that doesn't look good. Oh, hey, there's a button in there. Sorry, bud. Let's see what we get. Oh, we get some bone meal. Oh, well, we can use bone meal to make things grow. Maybe the flower or the tree might need the bone meal. I'm just going to grab a bunch just in case. And we will go down now hopefully it's not too big of a fall that i will hurt myself too much try to land on some of this greenery Oof, ouch okay that's okay work our way down oh hey we get the flower oh there's a couple there's a couple buttons up here Does that do anything no i think i've already clicked on that one let's just see here let's I just want to see if we give this some bone meal, what happens? Anything? Nothing. Okay, well, I had to try. 
Now, let's see. If we give you some bone meal. Hey. Oh, there we go. We grew the tree, and we get the button. That is great. Well, you know what? I think we're going to end it right here for today. That'll conclude today's episode. I hope you've had a good time. If you had, please leave a like. And if you haven't already, please hit the subscribe button. And join me again next time when we continue with Merlin's Magical Motel. Bye, everyone. Have a great day.